text-to-speech can be a very good thing for a lot of reasons. You can communicate with people in other languages and such. Um, but sometimes, sometimes it just does not work as intended. Or sometimes it does work as intended, just the voices are fucking annoying. Like the TikTok voice, for example. Another one, and raped it. What? Now, of course, that was an example of both things happening. It didn't work as intended, and it just, sound, and it just sounded stupid. Now, I've come across uh, one, one group of people that uses text-to-speech a fuckload is people who don't really want to put their own voices on the internet, so use the text-to-speech instead to tell stories. And that is what I want to show you really quickly here. Um, <laughs> Because it's it's fucking stupid. Um, yeah. <laughs> so this channel, um, it's it's really very much a mystery because this person doesn't give any information about themselves at all. Not even speaking in any of their videos. It's probably like some eight year old who just figured out how to use the text to speech bot. Um, and it it's just like Roblox Tower of Hell gameplay in the background with a bunch of like fucking text to speech bots speaking into your ears raping like ear raping you being <laughs> being like this thing happened in this story uh the the stories were probably stolen straight off of like r slash cringe or something so this is the channel that i found um it's not just this channel i'm pretty sure that these channels are all the same people but this luca roblox channel it it's verified and I, I can't see the subscriber count. I don't know if that's like a thing that you can turn on and off in YouTube Studio or something that you can just not have them show the fucking like <laughs> the subscriber count. But it's this channel is very linked to this channel. Lu two two. Whoever the fuck came up with that name, <laughs> like what the fuck? So you'll also see right off the bat that with this Lu Tutu channel, there's like six other channels connected to it that are all under like the name of Lu Tutu, whatever. Um, I I have no idea what the fuck is going on with these, but let's. I'm just gonna show you a little snippet of one of the videos on the Luca Roblox channel because that's where the majority of like the more stupid versions of the videos are. Because there's there's two different versions. There's there's the Roblox Blockber Blocksburg, or whatever the game is, not Blocksburg, Brookhaven. Um, there's the Roblox Brookhaven roleplay uh, videos, and there's the ones that are just straight-up text-to-speech bots with pictures of random-ass Roblox characters and random game play in the background. And that's the one that I'm going to show you right now. So this video in particular is called... <laughs> is called... Tomato, tea, text to speech, strawberry, my friend, rid of me for wanting to rob my boyfriend, <laughs> cherry, with the tags hashtag Roblox Storytime, hashtag Roblox, and hashtag Storytime. This, you could just tell that this is going to be absolutely fucking amazing video right now. To be my friend, ABC. Oh, thank God, I thought nobody was gonna say ABC. Lol, weird question, but can I add my BF? Sure, why not? <laughs> so, um, <laughs> this is the context of most videos. It just starts randomly with some random-ass characters, usually named very simple names like Kate or Jack. Um, so obviously common names. Um, also... Who the fuck is eating, like, chips in the background? I just hear, like, rustling like a fucking uh, Doritos bag or something in the background. And listen, I know that these videos are directed towards, like, small children, and that's fine and all. It's just... <laughs> listen, man, it's easy to make fun of kids' channels. Don't fucking judge me. But despite all of that, I am actually sort of interested in this story. So let's, let's see um, what happens next. Let's see uh, how the... Friend wanting to rob boyfriend. <laughs> Hi, guys. Hi, babe. Hey. ABC. Oh, I'm a bit late. Yeah, haha. -ha. So, what's everyone's name?
What do you mean, what's everyone's name? You can't see the poorly photoshopped uh, overlay of all the names? As the Roblox players would say, noob. <laughs> guys want to play Tower of Hell. Yes. Sure. Young guy, I'm so bored. What should I do? Oh, I know. I'm going to play Tower of Hell. Whoa, who is that guy over there? He is so cute. I'm going to spy on him. Ah, uh, yes, I immediately, whenever I see someone who I feel sexually attracted to, I just automatically am like, ooh, shit, I gotta spy on that person and commit a felony. Why are you spying on my BF? Oh, crap, I wasn't. I was looking at that guy. Yeah. I like how these videos are so directed towards kids that they censored the word crap in the subtitles. They put carp. Either that or it was actually, like, just a mistake, um, which I can still make fun of you for, so either way I win. Bean, Andrew, would you like me to get his attention? And no thanks. Andrew? Yes? I'll leave you two alone. Uh, what was that about? I, I just thought you looked nice and we could be friends. Damn it. No, I don't. Okay, so they went from censoring the word crap to saying damn it. Uh, you know, I don't feel like damn it is is necessarily a curse word, but it's definitely on a higher plane of the curse words than crap. Crap is like the six to eight range, and then you evolve into shit. Keep playing Tower of Hell. I'm actually starting to like these guys. I feel bad for when I'm going to dip. I'm less concerned about the characters, about what the character is going to do, then how concerned I am of what the fuck that noise is in the background. It sounds like a keyboard clacking times 50,000. I, I, I don't know I don't know what that sound is. Is it like it, it's probably a keyboard clacking, just like a keyboard from like 2001. Good game, guys. Yeah, that was really... So you're telling me that these teenagers uh, in the story played Tower of Hell for a month. <laughs> they they played Tower of Hell for a month. I've I mean you know, <laughs> listen I've pl I've played games for a long time. I have so many hours on so many games, <laughs> but I don't think that it's physically possible to play the same game for a month straight without stopping. <laughs> so the next bit of the video, they do this weird thing where they do like a face reveal. Um, so. After playing the same game together for a month straight, they finally showed each other their faces. I'm not going to show you that part because I don't know if these are actually like the, the actual people who made the video or if it's just random ass photos that um, this kid stole off of like the people's Instagram pages or something like that. I have no idea, so I'm not going to, you know, make any disruption of privacy if it's already been done. So, yeah, you, I mean, you can go watch this video for yourself if you really want to see a couple of pictures for, like, a split fucking second. Can I speak to you in private? Uh, yeah, sure. What is it? I'm sorry, but I, Alyssa is cheating on you with Andrew. How do you know? I joined them in Arsenal and you were calling each other babe and stuff. That could mean anything. Yeah, but she said I hope Jake doesn't join. I don't want him to know about us. So, I, I think that this video was probably actually made about, like, was actually made by the, about the age rating that um, the characters are, you know, 15, 14, because it seems like a big drama that would go on between teenagers, um, <clears throat> but it's, it's obviously directed towards children. I mean, who knows, this could actually be an eight-year-old who made all this shit up because it's... <laughs> Have you seen any, like, have you played Fortnite recently? You're telling me. You're welcome. What the heck, Alyssa? What's wrong, baby? I can't believe you cheated. Don't talk to me again. But I never. I never cheated. What is going on? I need to get to the bottom of this. <clears throat> okay, I just want to say, I don't think that anyone who was just wrongly accused of cheating on their boyfriend would just, like, suddenly go like all scooby-doo mystery style trying to figure out who like who done it i i mean that that might just be me but i, I <laughs>
I don't know. I don't know, man. Like I said, I, I have no idea. People are fucking weird. Who knows? I heard about you and Alyssa. Could you tell us what happened? Will Bethany told me she saw Alyssa and Jake in Arsenal flirting with each other. Dude, they can't even keep up with their own bullshit story correctly. They said Jake instead of Andrew. Like, seriously, how, how, can, how can I notice things, like, about the story? Like, how can I remember the story and how it's supposed to go better than the person who actually fucking, like, made it or put it into a video? Also, there's so many things wrong with this part. There's that. There's the fact that um, the text isn't in the right place. And there's the fact that um, well is spelled as we wheel. Like, I don't know, man. It's, it's like I said, it's probably a fucking eight-year-old who makes these. I can't give them that much of a hard time for it. I mean, I'm Joey. You guys seem cool. Can we be friends? Sure. I'm Katie, and this is Jake and Bethany. Nice to meet you guys. So, basically, the Alyssa character went undercover or something. I don't fucking know. I'm not really paying that much attention because I don't like paying attention to anything, but especially bullshit. So, uh, this is about the time in the video where the video is starting to get a bit long. Um, it's over ten minutes and shit. Uh, I, I'm, I'm just gonna skip until, like, the juicy part at the end of this whatever the fuck. I don't I don't know, just subscribe, okay? Can I speak to you in private? Okay. So what did you want to talk about? Pushes over. Ow, what was that for? You're a liar. Huh. I know your secret, Joey. Or should I say, Alyssa <gasps> She knows! She knows <laughs> You know what? I've had enough of this. Um, I'm just gonna end the video here because fuck conclusion. We don't need to come to the end of the story because we don't need to come to the end of the story because it's it's stupid story. Who the fuck even cares? You, you probably have clicked off the video by now anyways. Doesn't matter. So, um, what have we learned today? Text-to-speech is stupid and the wonders of, um... What's it called? And the wonders of commentary videos is that I can make like five minutes of this stupid text to speech video thing into a 12 and a half minute video. So, um, yeah, like and subscribe. Um, uh, fucking, I don't, I don't have a witty like thing to say. I can't say that text to speech will fuck you in the ass if you don't. Um, just subscribe because it's cool.